What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today we're bringing back one of my favorite decks of all time and uh, we're putting a few new twists on it. This is the Spidow Splash deck. Now the cool thing that Spidow has is he has this card over here. Mr. Splashy McSplash Hot Lava. And you are going to place into that environment Hibernating Berry which is going to grow every single turn by 4 which is ridiculous and it also activates your Pier Cub, which is really a 3 cost, becomes like a 5-4, which is really, really good. Uh, you also have Galactic Cactus in order to splash, uh, which will activate your same cards. Um, you also have Fig, which is going to add a RNG aspect to it, that when your cards take little bits of damage, they're going to actually transform. So, for example, in this environment, your cards will transform into something random, and then it will attack, and sometimes you'll get some good value out of that. Running Molokel in order to increase your 5 cost cards to 6 cost cards, running a couple of the Raptors, Blast Radish Hunters, because you play this on 3, you play Molokel on turn 4, uh, that'll turn into 2 4 drops, which is really great value. Anyway, a really good card in itself, and this also works pretty well, I, I would say, with the um, Transfiguration, just having two minions on the field teamed up that three. Uh, I'm also running Juggernaut, so I decide not to run Fireweed. I usually like use Fireweed for the environments, and very often you want to like put these on the field and then stick an environment on top of it, and Fireweed does not provide that to you, because it's not a team-up card, even though it is much better than <laughs> than just Hot Lava. So we're gonna, that's really one of the experiments, I'm running some Reincarnation for some RNG, and the other experiment I'm running is Juggernaut. This is sort of the opposite, but it still has Splash Synergy. You can put this into Hot Lava, and it won't take any damage because of the armor. It can get hit by your Galacta, and it, again, it won't take any damage because of the armor so you can really get a lot of value out of that let's see how this deck does hope you guys enjoy this should be really really fun um i don't i guess we should keep luck score today so we'll get that going uh question is what would we do about the channel point bets now this is the thing we always do at the beginning of the stream everyone's like guys gambling addiction this is this is so important um I guess we can keep track of wins and losses. We should have time for 10 games with this deck, but the games are going to go pretty quick. Because it's not a super serious deck, maybe I'll say instead of 8 and 2, we'll say 7 and 3. Why don't I just go 8 and 2? You know what? I'm going normal. We'll see if people actually bet, because most people usually bet yes. So I'm going to start a regular prediction today. We're going to be keeping track of luck score, but also keep track of wins and losses kind of verbally in the chat. Do you think this deck will go at least 8 and 2? It's somewhat competitive. Not really. <laughs> I don't know. But um, if you if you are one of the daring individuals who think that this complete luck-based RNG this deck is going to absolutely rock it, then vote yes, and if not, go jump in a lake. Alright, I'm just keeping this combo. So it started it starts for the next five minutes. People over here in the live stream, of course. Use their beloved fries. That's the channel points you get for watching the live Twitch stream. And uh, let's get it going here. We'll get the luck score activated. That's what I'm doing right now. What the? What in the heck? I haven't answered. <laughs> get wrecked. It's nice just the moment we get a pair cub or a uh, sleeping berry, it'll kind of be active. Pretty cool. Pretty damn cool. Uh, this goes... I think this goes on heights. Just to play around like black hole and stuff like that. I'm curious with this very non-competitive deck, how many people will still vote for the 8 and 2? I mean, we go 8 and 2 with non-competitive decks all the time, so... Yeah, no. So we'll either play Molokel or Fig. Uh, you're annoying. Aha! It's more Splash. Bruh! Alright. Kind of bruh moment. I could just do this for the 4 drop. Bruh! I could also just Shamrock it. I think I'm just going to play Malka. It's kind of sad, but... <laughs> okay. Aha! An upgrade! I don't know. Uh, and it still dies. It did its job. Don't have Bungie. 
This seems like that deck where you like, you usually do it with a, uh, I'm gonna shamrock at this now. Bruh! I think this is the play. We have the the trapper set up here, just nice. I guess it's Emex Sports. I thought it was the deck where you do with like the fossil head, and you keep buffing it, but he just didn't get fossil head, so he happened to be running sumo. This is a nice berry blast. Please no coach. And if he has coach, this rain actually sort of takes care of it. Okay, that's a little bit annoying. So we either have three and three. This looks pretty good. This looks, uh, you want to actually do this after. So we're going to go three. This is how we deal with this, right? This is two plus two. This will actually die to Berry Blast next turn. So you want to do this first. I'm not buffing this because I just want the five four. I could have actually made this hit face with proc his block this turn and then turn into a five four next turn, perhaps. If I would have looked at his block meter and thought a little bit harder, uh, that's probably what I would have done. We'll see if we can get lucky and roll one to redeem my poor decision. Nope! Terrible play. <laughs> no! Okay, that's a problem. Houston, we have a problem. Slight problem. Eh... I, 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 I goofed. Now this is going to be a 5-3. It's a little easier to deal with. I think this is fine because it at least blocks this and does a little bit of heat. Uh, I think I'm changing this one up. Rodeo. Dear God. Wonder if he'll move the fig just for fun value. <laughs> that would be cool. Yes, he did! Okay, come on. We need a miracle. Come on, Great Zucchini, where are you? Meteor. I feel like we need to kill this at some point. Let's just work on this slowly but surely. <laughs> ah, come on! Complete garbage. Hey, can we double Berry Blast him? Uh-oh! This is definitely our best chance of winning this game. Do no California rolls. No, 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 more defensive ends, too, that would... That. No! Okay. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we're kind of dead. All right, so this is definitely the play. Kind of. Okay, we need... Oh, no. Uh... Maybe we'll get Jumping Bean or something. Damn, Gladiator Coach. That's rough. Ah? Uh? Ah? Uh? Ah? Uh? Whee! Come on, man. What's our top deck? Woo! That could work. Berry Blast don't do anything, so I have to do this, right? Well, we can Berry Blast the coach. Alright, so I'll do it here. Miracle play? Oh boy, we got some B! Oh wait. Uh, okay, so we're still doing this, because the, the coach, the, okay, the gladiator still messes this up. That's not bad. Can we play both of these? No. Under no circumstance. Okay, that's the laser beam. That's nice. Laser beam lives here too, so it hits him again. We'll do uh, two damage in this turn. I don't even know if that's good. Does he have a removal card? If he has a fruitcake, we die. If he has a bungee, we die. If he has any tricks going viral, we die. <laughs> Come on, man. Okay. 
We're in, we're in decent shape here. This berry blast looking spice. Come on. Okay. Uh huh. All right. Right then. Too bad we're we can't berry blast him in the face this turn. Um. So, I think that's a sumo. So, I'm pretty sure the play is do this. And then we berry blast this one. And this way he has to move the laser beam in order not die himself. And then he, the sumo doesn't hit us in the face when he moves this. Or rodeo, I guess it's the same thing. So he has to move the laser beam. <laughs> We're still in this game? Oh, that's a problem. <laughs> We're done. We're done. We're done. Come on, man. Okay. That's a row and one. Damn! <laughs> Extremely unlucky. Uh, 13 points of unluck. That was just. I had a few points of luck to get the laser beam. Damn, that was a good game, though. <laughs> Three points of luck for laser beam. Didn't end up helping you. Fail. Burying three would have won? Laser beam, bury, and the 2 2 goes there. So which one then does he move? Bury bless that. If he had a sumo in there, or rodeo, then he would, well then if he moved the berry, then the laser beam would be active. So he'd have to move the laser beam to two, you're right. If I would have put the, bear, the, the, the hibernating berry in three, it would have been good. Why didn't I didn't think of that. Oh, Trapper in two would have killed the would have killed the laser beam, and then he would have won in lane two. So because he had the trapper in his hand, it actually didn't end up making a difference. But you guys are right. The correct play was was the berry in three, just because then if he moved something, he would have to move. He wouldn't have a good option to move something. It didn't end up making a difference. But a misplay nonetheless. <laughs> we all make mistakes, Fry. Thanks for rubbing it in. It's okay. I don't need your sympathy. I don't feel that that embarrassed. <laughs> I only want to... <laughs> um, I guess I'll keep this for the cheese cutter. I don't really know how to mulligan this deck. What are we actually looking for? I guess this is good. Should I look for a two drop instead of this? God damn it. It looks windy. Yeah, I have the windows open because it's kind of like warm in this apartment. I should just take all my <laughs> clothes off now. No, Fry. Instead of opening the windows. <laughs> Your mom made a mistake. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Bruh. If you wish upon a... All right, we got the um, the hibernating berry all set up here. Let's hope we don't get alien news to the Ice Age. Aha! Is three cost four three worth it here? Bruh. Nah. We can do better. Bruh. Uh, it's probably just gonna be Fig and one now. It'll make the two for one trade. And then not transform the berry because this berry's getting out of control. Ooh. It's a cool haunted pumpkin. Bruh, that doesn't do a damn thing. That doesn't do a damn Why is he putting this in lava? Are you high? He wants it back, but we're doing eight damage to him. What's the most damage I can do now? Uh, we have another four. We have five here. Oh, man. Um... I'm so tempted just to... 
I mean, I can control. I have a lot of things I can do. I think I'm just going to play this. It's a good two-for-one trade this turn. If this grows anymore, and then we'll do like this next turn, I suppose. And we want to be able to get rid of this. We're still doing eight to him, though. Crazy, man. So that's a really good. Now, again, this survives, kills this huge minion, and turns into jumping feet. <laughs> it's the dream. It's the dream. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> I love getting I don't like run jumping beam, but I just get it from things. It's amazing. Ah. Reminds me of that other highlight video. Except this time it was only one jumping beam. Uh, that'll go in the um That'll go in the highlight camp. What? Dude. Dude. What is okay. This is being insane. I, okay, my gimp is driving me nuts. This is what it changed to. This is what it changed to. It, it's just being silly. Oh, come on, man. Today is April 30th. Big jumping seed. I don't know why my gimp, it doesn't let me change the size of things. Ever. There. Gosh, you're nuts. Man. Perfect. There. Now we're good. How many clips in each comp? I don't know. Go to the comps and see. It's like 10 maybe? Approximately. Maybe more, maybe maybe twelve. They're usually less than a minute. I don't even know. Hmm. Nah, I'll just keep this hand. Why not? <laughs> Why the hell not? Uh, I think I'm gonna spend this. We'll probably go with both of these here. I'll block whatever he plays. The big minion. I wonder if he's... It's just Sumo, though. I, I hope it's main pirate. That would be... Sumo's a little awkward here. God damn it. <laughs> he's moving it back. <laughs> he's moving it back. <laughs> See ya. Come on, man! Alright, at least we'll get value from the fig. Bruh! Ooh, that's nice. Hmm. I don't know what that's gonna be. I'll just play around some dumb... I don't know. It plays around line dancing, and it also plays around... Well, line dancing would've gone here to move out. But it also plays around, um... I wasn't thinking of that. Uh, just uh, Stealthy Imp, which usually goes in lane 1 because of block meter, but could have been Stealthy. Okay, so he's gonna he's gonna get the back one here. That would be the smart, because this one dies first. So you want to nerf this one. Um, I'm probably just gonna maul kill now. Instead of figging. We can do this fig play later. <sighs> See what's in the box. Bow, bow. We get top deck of them all, Cal. Hmm. Nice high health minion with some bullseye. This will go here. Uh, these trade. Hmm. All things considered, this isn't that bad. I'm probably just gonna go for a huge splash play here. <laughs> Did this one die? That's oh, so annoying. Maybe I won't develop the Galacta quite yet so we get more splash value. I don't know, man. Maybe I'll just fig here.
So if we block, rain does not help us, but how super will make these actually survive? I could also just, just splash everything. Just wondering, do we develop this? I don't think we do. I think I'd like a shot. I can always do this later. I think I'd like a shot at getting super here and getting these transformed. Oh. First, we have to block. <laughs> nope. Okay, so this is a good trade, regardless. We get something good. No, we don't. Not good at all. Completely terrible and unredeeming. It's splashy, splashy time! Should probably save this for one of these lanes, huh? This on this only transforms the 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 the, the fig because it's on the left side. So we can do three and one. Maybe I'll just do these two. Kind of die regardless. This is probably a um a big dude. This is probably Gargolith. I I don't have a way of playing around that though. It's just like this. I don't have a way of doing six. I can do five plus one, but then this only does four, so it doesn't work. Plus it has seven, huh? We are kind of screwed. Boom, boom, booty, boom, boom. Okay, okay, wins. I get the point. Uh, I forgot about Meteor. Yeah. Shut up, Spido. Sorry. <sighs> I don't know how to do this play. I could just set this up and put the berries here, I suppose. I probably want to do the splash play before I do this. It's not good this turn, though, because everything only has one health. <laughs> what am I going to do? I should probably just make the best play for this turn, huh? Which is... Like this, I suppose. I really like Cactus on too. Just another Gargler. It's a rodeo. Ain't my rodeo. Let's move somewhere. Here she blows! I wanted the reincarnate. Really? He got the best. Wow, any of these? Well, this one would have been sad. This one would have been lethal, actually. Come on, man! This one just dies for free now. Bruh! Alright, well, we do need a miracle to win, so. Do you know? How it go? Bro, bro, bro. All right, Todd, guys, it's miracle time. We have a few leaps. Let's go. <laughs> the the for the three lanes do survive. Nothing moves. There's no point in developing this because it just gets pinged. So we have three figs. 
We basically need a great zucchini to get back in this game. We need something really, really good. Real good. We need... <laughs> I don't even know. I don't, I, like, maybe... I don't think, like, Astro Vera... Kernel Corn... Eh, Kernel Corn doesn't even do that much. It's amazing how we can get, like, Kernel Corn and... And Dragon, and they're, we're still gonna, probably gonna lose. Uh, if he plays going viral, it just wins. Fortunately. Two cards in hand. Okay, so this lives. Survey sets! Uh, that's above average. Survey sets! God damn it! Oh, another one. Okay, that's better. Survey says one more time. Complete garbage. <laughs> Bye, Garks. I'll see you. See you. Uh, we automatically lose? Thank you, Dark Souls. Aha! We'll do three damage before we go out in style. Nah, we're done. Uh, we're 0 and 2 with this deck, aren't we? <laughs> no, we're 1 and 2. I wonder how many people voted yes for this deck, by the way. 50 50? Guys, it's literally 50 50. 50% 50 of you people, people, thought that this deck would actually win 8 out of 10 games. Oh yeah, we don't do any damage. Uh, but we are 1 and 2, so it is still possible, guys. We just have to win 7 strike games. Fitty fitty, guys. I voted no not to be mean. I would have voted no. <laughs> Think this. Oh, it's Samen. My old friend. The E stands for Germany. I should be, like, trying really, really hard here. We gotta win some games, guys. Where's Molecule? Is this just good against a fan? Okay, I'm keeping this in. I don't care. This is insanely good, actually. Whee! A really good 2-drop would be nice, too. Can I have, like, a doubled mint here? That's not bad. That's an applesauce. I'm playing this. I don't know about all y'all, but I'm playing this. It's an app upgraded apple saucer. God damn it. I'm keeping all this. These guys are OP. These guys are going to be taking over this game. Remember that other game? This game is the deadest game. Watch him pogo here. Uh, I guess we don't do this against a gravestone. Bruh! Bruh! I'm gonna space these out so I can do the block meter a little bit smarter next turn. There was no way of moving this. I think moving this and play the environment, that would have been nice. Uh -huh. Little does he know. I might Molokale. I can Molokale sort of at any point. I sort of want to do it before I do this combo anyway. I can also let this happen for one more turn here. I guess it depends how big of a threat he plays here. I think the more he commits, the more likely I Molokale. No! Uh... No! Bruh! Da 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 dum, ba dum ba da da dum ba da dum bum ba dum ba da dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. Let's go. <laughs> That's eight damage just right up nine actually. <laughs> this is fine. He overcommitted. Now we're just gonna wreck him in his face. It does eight and one splash from the thing. Oh, this is fine. Guys, we are totally fine here. You want to 
want to guarantee proc this block here? I think this is correct. I wonder if this should have gone to face because of our health total. Probably should. Bear Lava, we could go for rolling a 1 maybe. Go Lava Bear in 2. Uh, this is a much stronger play. The Molecule is insane here. Smoke Bomb. Interesting. Okay, good. Okay, get a card. Huge, by the way. <laughs> Splash Synergy, babies! Gravestone. Bruh. Okay, so this throws two imps and dies. Whee! Whee! Ah! Ugh, it's so annoying. Killed all of his own guys. Nah! <laughs> Exploitation! What?! It kills itself, though. It kills itself. <laughs> we just play this. We just play this. And we pass. And we pass. And we pass. Wait, this doesn't die. Now it does. Now it does. Hold on. Now it does. Now we got him. Now we got him. Guys, we conjured this from Fruitcake. Ah! Uh. See ya. See ya. See ya. See ya. See you later. Whee! Yeet. Let's go. Another one. And you already used Infinity Clones. He needs a bungee plumber now. Or uh, another trapper, I guess. Huh? That prickly pear was so clutch. No! We need to roll one. Come on! Come on! Yeah! <laughs> Pure skill! Pure skill! God! <laughs> I wonder if that's gonna make the highlight come. Hmm! Hmm! Betting 20 points of luck. What the heck just happened, bro? <laughs> oh, so good. Shard, etc. <laughs> oh we conjure. Prickly from fruit cake. Uh, clutch. <laughs> prickly. We roll a one for the win. <laughs> that was so great. That was so good. Highlight central, guys. Oh, same man, you was running a splash zombie deck against splash <laughs> plants. <laughs> Good game, same man. My dear friends. <sighs> Is this good in here? I don't know. I feel like the fig and the and this are anti-synergy. I wonder if I should ditch the fig. Kind of fun, but not really useful. Oh man. Fig just messes up every one other card you have on the field. It's the real problem. I wonder if I set this up already. So we can bury West. Hmm. Probably not. Unbelievable game, guys. Puff shrimp? We don't have to rush this. We can do this on four. I could go two, three, four. We have a nice three drop too, so. So it is. 
We'll get better going. Is this good? Is this 3-3? Three, three? I don't I mean... Here, we have two team-ups in hand. Is this nuts? Did I play this? I think... Well... Huh. It can also just get blasted. We might get a better... We really need later game cards. Oh, uh, as tempting as it is. As tempting as it is. I think I'm just gonna go with this. This is a very, very solid play, and... We're really only going to be able to trigger this twice max, and that's if it doesn't get hurt this turn, which it very likely will. And this becoming something more expensive after we go 4, 5, etc. is probably better. Rat, I'm not really playing a Wrath, maybe more Fruitcake, but even Summoning can sometimes kill this. Garbage. Bungie. That would have killed it. I'm happy half of my card is... This card's better in the late game, and half of this one's dying this entire one, whatever. <laughs> Kinda sweet. The question is, which one of these do we go with? I guess if he fruitcakes here, it's fine. So, I'm going to set this play out. This is the one that kind of grows over more over time. And if he fruitcakes this, I just do it again next turn, which is amazing. Bungies. What? Fruitcake kills it anyway. The rocket, okay. Creative. Uh, I would have just saved the rocket for next turn, because that's a, I mean, it's a, a bungee plumber is a valuable card. Hmm. Um, it's, not, it's not going in the fail count. Uh, it's okay. Da da dum bum ba dum ba da ba da da dum Let's go. I don't think this would kill the dead bear. I think this would die first. I think so. Yes, we're doing eight. It's just so strong. People are just playing barrels into us, man. This is just how we're getting our damage here. Bro. Now let's see if the reincarnation can clutch it. Come on, man. Um... Him spending that bungee was interesting. <sighs> I think it's three plus three? I think this is the play. This is gonna have... It's two for each other plant, so it's gonna have seven. It dies to bungee, but he's used, a, he's used two bungee plumbers already, so I'm really not afraid of that. Chickening? Chickening makes him lose automatically. I think I'm doing this play, man. This is awkward. This is just here to proc the block. Not really gonna be able to activate it anyway. Final mission, I guess, to this one, but that means the four hits face now. And another. What? Rolls a 1! 16 damage for the win! <laughs> what the heck just happened? Come on, man. Bruh. They're all right. So, um... Yeah. That just... I don't know. 40... Oh my gosh. I can't deal with this. I can't, I can't, I can't. Can you please? Can you? It keeps on resizing. It keeps on resizing my text automatically and it's pissing me off. Oh, I know the problem. This is the problem. There. Now it's gonna be fine. God damn it. There. It's beautiful now. I figured out the problem. Yay! Nine points of luck. So we're three and two now. 
Guys, five more games. <laughs> this is very doable. Hey, Galacta. That sure is... That sure is... Sure got a pretty mouth. Do I keep three of these? Ah, screw it. I'm doing it. Go rule this guy. I think I play this on too. Restock to your deck? Nah, I can't do too many every day. Oh, good trade. Oh, that's great. Then he goes after this and just activates the pair. Plus we have a Molokale. This is incredible. Yes! Ah, watch him make a play here. <laughs> wow. This Molokale is going to turn these guys into six drops now, bros. He's not even going after it. Okay. That's the play. He's. This might be the deck where he just grows this guy, we'll see. Buddy Dude Man Guy, hello. Welcome back. I've been good, how you doing? I'm gonna get really greedy on this. Um, we could do this. It plays around like, you know, him buffing this minion, but what did he buff it with? Hardy Tree? I can't really do damage. I think this is okay. It, worst case scenario, it sets it up for the pair next turn. Oh no. <laughs> did he really get this from middle manager? <laughs> Bruh, okay, it's it we give it a meteor. Oh my gosh, that's so annoying. Okay, time for splash. Wee wee We become in a must meteor situation. Nice. The pair cup would have well, anyway. Eh, it's only a 4-2. I could probably just ignore this. I think it's just Meteor Fig here or something like that. Screw this guy. I'll just Fig. Let's figure it out. There. It's a lot of heat. And now his Rocket he has to decide. Okay. That's fine. He's not going to get any value of the Nebula. He really just used that... To sort of preserve a 4 2. He's down to 3 health. We're in great shape here. Yeah. <laughs> Got him. 10 points of luck. Alright. So now we're 4 and 2. We could do this, guys. Guys, it's doable. Yay. Probably just lose the game, relax, it's okay. It's the same guy. I like the double reincarnation. It's kind of sad against him for a number of reasons. Alright. Yeah, Roy! Roy, man! Question is, do I develop this already? I think I do. Well, I think I do. Me thinks we do. Have I ever played Slay the Spire? No, it's like a kind of a fun game, but I'm really getting into new games these days. Bro! Man's got some broski. Let's just pass. Fuck one. Mm -hmm. Guys, I'm timing you out for the spam of the thing. Uh, next time I'm just gonna ban you. I should ban people more often, I'm too nice.
I just ban one person permanently. Doesn't feel bad. Man. It's fine. Play us in height, just play around black hole, it doesn't really matter. I could play Molokel, we'll see what these reincarnations, these are always the X factor. It's probably better to play Molokel sooner than later. This is nice though. This might be the play. If he commits a big guy, I'll do it. Um, so we don't have a way of killing this. It's time for some clap. It's time to clap hard. Where does this go? Is, our, is his block meter an issue? I guess we don't want this to take damage, right? This happens end of turn, so the stomp on is actually not going to activate at all. It's just going to turn into a puff shroom, and that's it. Get clap zero. It's actually a perv. It's actually the best answer. Think of it. What would have been better than that? That was marvelous. The clutch. The clutch clap. That was so lucky. So uh, we're adding, we're adding luck for that. Five points of luck just for that. PGZ Heroes has somehow spawned an entire religion around Star to Lord thanks to us viewers. And I don't know how to feel about that. <sighs> um, so I think pair, 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 pairs is the play here. This creates a really good setup for the Molokale, theoretically. I can also do this play. And keep the clap going. I like the pairs though, man. I think that's the plan. Well, super powers. <laughs> Weed spray would have been a little, a little something there. Bites. Strong teacher. Cards. You have a few rolling stones, at least the teacher dies. That's a cool escape through time. Did the right one. Uh, but it dies anyway. Uh, no, that doesn't do anything. That just gives, oh, it, yeah, it dies anyway to the clap. That was a complete waste. Thank you, Ilya, for some, uh, thank you, there was cactus just Gifted one to Ilya. See you later. It doesn't turn into a puff because we have a team up there already, man. Uh, I think it's time for Molokil. What do you think? <laughs> okay. <laughs> we got a Molokil at some point here. Don't concede. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> this clap has been getting so much value, though. Make a clap deck. Uh, I keep on trying. They're always terrible. Clap with team ups, maybe? Protect Witch Hazel with team ups. Go nuts. Man threw his bone in a lake. I want a ball kill so badly, though. Um, so we're five and two. It just. <laughs> he just laid, laid this chump champion there and then called farting and leaving the room. Come on, man. Don't do that. It smells. It's not good. I think you're methane gas all up in here. We're five and two, guys. Three more. <laughs> I think he lathered. How did the mathematician deal with his constipation? He worked it out with a pencil. He worked it out with a pencil. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> Disgusting. Who thought of that joke? Ugh. Come on, man. All right. I think this is the sniper that just dicks around. All right. This is the guy that, like runs baseball zombie. Umbrella? 
onion clap. I'll write it down. This is pretty damn good. I think I'm playing this card. I think I'm setting up the pair too. Umbrella. That would be Green Shadow. Starfruit. Yeah, it's this guy. Remember that other guy? This guy is the dumbest guy. Thank you, Simple Tricks. It's 44 months. I still owe you guys the four month, the four year badge. Are you up to four years? Oh, almost. Very close. I have a four year badge. I just have to do some of my very long list of things to do. With my life. Oh, my life. Yeah. Come on and take it, girl. Come on and take it, because I... Maybe this would have been better just with the Molokel next turn. I wonder if I should have just let this die. Huh. He just runs all cardboard robots and bucket boys. And then comes in with some weird, like, mixed up grave digger. I know he can't run in this deck, but... How though? 44 months? How? Yeah, it's just been watching for years. Years! I've been a Twitch partner for about 50 months, so you've literally gone like 90%. Basically. Don't you know I stayed around with my head? The, the environment's really good here. I'll do it after just to be sure. Cool! It's freaking Pine Clone! Bruh! Why? This is just better because it kills it. You're so annoying. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Genetic experiment actually wins this trade now because I did the stupid. I did the do. This is a pretty good play, though. <laughs> An insanely good play. Damn! Some top deck madness right there. Chronically, I would never find it without phone cats. Yeah, a lot of my old, old viewers. Back in 2016, he came from phone cast. Alright, he's running Marching Boy. That's got that's guaranteed. Easy lethal. Nah. <laughs> um so we're six and two. We'll honor the um the San Antonio no, the uh, Philadelphia 76ers. Whoa, <laughs> get old. By changing it to 76 guys. We're 6 and 2. It was just the all boy deck. We, we have to win two more games. We've won our last like five straight, I think. We were 1 and 2 at some point, so. Now we're up against Pepe Zemek. I would not have found you without 31 and 0 control nightcap. Don't you know how I did around? It's pretty good in. With my head hanging down, I'm too get. Why is everyone playing middle manager on heights? I don't understand what's going on. I don't even know what's going on. Who was my first viewer? The first one I remember on Twitch was a kid named C. Boros. When I was a young warthog. I know that dies anyway, but he's going for the hurry tree. I think he still pops around the channel every once in a while. 
Uh, Duck Game for Life also was one of like the first 10, 10 viewers. Who else do I know from then? I wonder if Johnny was one of like the first 10 viewers. Don't you know what? Sing along with my hand Back in my day, you would have had this payload moving already. What the heck is this? So stupid. We are six and two now. Sets up the molecules a little better here. <laughs> Back in my day, Hardy Treat was SH1T. Ah! Okay, at least we're getting this down to a, a, like a manageable health, but... That's... What the hell? The Juggernaut. I have to make this, man. Fossil Head Juggernaut. That's the real Juggernaut. Jug juggernaut. How do you how do you get your fossil heads reliably though? Oh, it's so annoying. Should have never ever made you cry. We need like a jumping bean next turn, I suppose. I don't think there's any point. Is there any two drop that helps us here? Like this could turn into something next turn. I, I you know, is it you know like primal pea shooter? Is there any two drop that helps us? Snow pea. I think this is more likely to turn into an answer next turn. No! Quick! No! Oh no! I ran out of time! I thought too long! We got Wing Nut! It wouldn't have done any damage! Bro! <laughs> this Wing Nut might just make us win though! Oh, I tried. Since you been know. Don't you know how I sit around with my head hanging down and I wonder who's loving who? Maybe I should put something bigger here. I should have put the... well, I feel like this just kills like it could bungee this. Your fruitcake's it. We could roll three. <sighs> Man, we would have been in decent shape if I would have ran out of time then now so we lose it. Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, that's tough. We don't really have any answers to that in the stack. The big guy. <sighs> All right. Well, we'll play. We're, we're, we're five. We're, so we're five and, and, and we're six and three now. We're six and three. We'll play one more game. But the answer, my dear friends, the outcome is no. Those who bet 50-50. It was a 50-50 bet, and we almost came in clutch, man. The answer is no. We won seven or fewer games. We'll see about game 10 here. Now you know I think I need my hand now. It's a good setup for the paracut either way. Ah, uh, come on, man. Can't even go after us. Who is loving you? 
is going for laser base. Why don't I do this next turn so he actually thinks he has the laser base play? <laughs> and the play, we're going to double counter him next turn. This is such a debate right here. Look, he's going for laser base alpha. We know that already. Oh, no, wait, this doesn't answer laser base. Well, well, at least Berry Blast him, so he can't do anything. Then we'll answer this later. Oh, that's fine. Oh, we don't have last save, but we can do it the next turn. It's still good. Shut up. Oh, he's so, so lonely. I don't think, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Speaking of exploitation. Since you went away, don't you know I sit around with my head hanging down? Still ends up a 5 4. Nice. And I wonder who's loving you. <laughs> Have to work on that one. Shut up! And take my money. Shut up! Why did the prediction change from 50 50 after the close? Did it change? I don't think it changed. Oh, right. It's 4159. I don't know how it changed. It ended up being 59% no, 41% yeah. Someone cheated. I don't know who it was, but somebody, somebody cheated. Bro! That's uncool. All right, I'll just do the fun play. <laughs> it's not necessarily the smart play, but it is the fun play. Ow. Come on, give me Bluesberry. <laughs> Should I Berry Blast him in the, in the freaking face? Don't you know I... There was a snake in my boot. I think it's just not playing Molokel as the player. <laughs> Molokel for fun? Fine. I could do this play, too. I want to be a ninja. Smoke bomb would be harsh. See ya. And it's mall kill time. It's going for deadly. <laughs> Bruh. <Bro. laughs> That's gotta be lethal. He could block and get infinity clones. You never know. Nope. Good enough. Alright, guys. Overall, pretty lucky stream. Oh, I forgot to add unluck when we lost. So it's 25 unluck. And 95 luck. To commemorate Windows 95. The best operating system ever created. <laughs> I can't even say that with a straight face. I can't do it. But it was revolutionary. Which is good. It got, it got the PCs out there. Alright guys, that was the uh, I'm gonna splash your dad deck. I actually went 7-3, and three, so obviously a very highly competitive deck we got here. Hope you guys enjoyed. That stream was amazing. Peace. This is Fry.